So we're here with Anne, she's a manager, facilitator, organiser, founder, everything at Dumb Chapel Cycle Hub. So Anne, can you tell us a wee bit about this big family fund day? Sure, um, so last year was our first uh, cycle event. Um, in the past, as you know, we've been involved with fun days in the park but we wanted to have an event that people would actually be getting on bikes and cycling. So we created our Get Active Cycle Challenge, which last year went really well. Um, we had 120 people taking part, from babies right through to, to people in their 50s, 60s and 70s. Uh, it was a fantastic day and we decided it was so successful. The feedback was amazing last year, so we wanted to do it again. So we're holding the event again uh, on Sunday the 3rd of September and it's going to be even bigger and better. There will be music, there will be entertainment at the start and finish. Um, we've got a fully supported uh, marked route uh, for people to cycle. They're going to be looked after by our amazing team of volunteers um, and people will be able to go and it's completely free to enter. Uh, people will be able to cycle a route, uh, be it a short route, they can choose to, to cycle only a four mile route if they've got little children or they can cycle a 20 mile route. Uh, along the way, they'll be fully supported by our marshals who will give them encouragement. Uh, there'll be snacks and refreshments along the way as well. And they'll get a medal and a goodie bag at the end of lots of cycling goodies. I'm Roz and I joined Drumchapel Cycle Hub about two years ago. Um, I'm coming up for almost three years that I've been retired. I was looking for things to do. I had a bike but it was nervous about going out myself. It's the best thing I could have done is joining Drumchapel Cycle Hub. It's lead rides, it's for everybody, all ages and all abilities. I don't need to worry where I'm going or what I'm doing so I'm taken care of and my bike's been taken care of as well. Last year you took part in the activity we're advertising today. Could you tell us a wee bit about your experience on that activity? Oh, oh certainly. It was great fun from beginning to end. After the registration you were given your number for your bike, bike was checked, then we set off according to our abilities whether it was four miles, twelve miles or I chose the twenty miles. And there was arrows in the ground to show you, there was um, stewards along the route um, so you wouldn't get lost, you don't need to worry about that and th at the end there was refreshments and uh, it, it was just a lovely atmosphere. Um, on the way back um, we went, it, assembled into the hall and we were given medals and a goodie bag but everybody was so friendly right along the route and everything. I thoroughly enjoyed it and I would sincerely recommend it to everybody. So Anne, that sounds amazing, it's fantastic. Can you tell us if somebody wanted to register for the event, how would they go about that? So there's a couple of ways that they can do that. First of all, they can go onto our website and they can click to register and they complete a simple Google form which has got their basic contact details and medical information for emergencies. And can you just tell us, just for the purpose of the audience, what the website's called? The website is drumtapplecyclehub.org.uk